thicken it a little bit because this is going to end up being the gravy. So you want to add it while it's hot, while you, while your juice here is hot. You don't want to add it if it's cooled down too much in between. You can always, you know, either put it in a pan or a in a bowl or whatever and microwave it get it back up to temperature. All these little little bubbles in there. Make sure all of these get completely dissolved first. Before you add anything to it. Because if you don't make sure that all of these get, you know, mixed in there really good and are gone, then you'll have these really disgusting little flower pockets. <laughs> so um, but the, you know flour is a you know it's a good thickening agent you can also use cornstarch or you know some people use tapioca but that's usually for sweeter things and pastries so um cornstarch and flour either way but make sure you don't have any little bubbles in there make sure it gets dissolved all good. Hi. <laughs> the broth that we've already thickened add these to taste and add whatever spices you really want rabbit is kind of a sweeter meat a lot like chicken or fish so you know you can kind of season them basically just the same way that you would I like spearmint, it's a sweeter herb or whatever and tastes really good. It smells really good, doesn't it? That smell good? It seems like we're adding a lot of, of spices here, but they're really not, considering these are going to go into three different pies. You want to smell that? Yeah. Salt is actually one that the number one thing, if you don't have enough of it, it's pretty obvious right off. All of this meal will be done from scratch. Ah.